Okay, so I have my sweaters for fall and winter. I need to hang those wool sweaters up. These are just turtlenecks that go in my drawers and then these get hung up as well. My comfies like sweatpants and long sleeves and stuff. And then this is the bin of my cottage summer sweaters that I will not be using this winter. Oh no, wait, that I like to use when I go skiing and snowmobiling and stuff. So that actually will come out. But that's gonna go in there. And then here's where I hang up all of my um, zip up sweaters. I might put that bin down there and then put the extra pillows on it and then put these guys up there. It's what we're working with. That, those are the stairs to go to the attic. So that's our closet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't put on primer. Oh well. After all that foundation and concealer I put on, I'm just slowly seeing this thing come to life. Okay, good morning. Happy Sunday. Today's Sunday. I don't know why I had to think about that. Um, I'm off to my friend's baby shower. My friend's coming to pick me up in about an hour or so. I still need to wash off my tan and get dressed and figure out what I'm wearing and also wrap her gift. So I figured I'd share with you her gift and my friend who's picking me up is also pregnant. Her baby shower is next weekend, so this is hers. So in these two bags, I've thrifted baby clothes for them. They're coming over Thursday, so I think I'm just gonna leave the thrifted clothes for them to give them later on. This is pretty much everything that I have for my friend. I need to write in her card, but these were on her registry. It's like a baby either and then some spoons. And then this snack cup, I got these all off Indigo. Then some baby washcloths, I think. They have little elephants on them and then just plain blue. She's having a boy, so I thought the colors were nice. They're these cute little onesies. I don't know if you can see it, but they have little like safari animals on it. And then this one is cute, this like mustardy yellow one, but it has a little elephant on the side. And I thought that was cute. I feel like these are her colors, so got of those. Her and her husband are big into skiing and snowmobiling and all that stuff so I got a little dashing through the snow with a porcupine on a snowmobile and then like a bunny skiing book which is pretty cute because it's like teaching the kid or like the bunny I guess how to do the jumps and I'm pretty sure that's what she did as she was growing up so I thought that was a good find. I think I got this on Amazon and then it's an indigo and then her husband is a farmer so I actually thrifted this with her, but I told her like I'm buying it for her, but she can't have it until her shower. But I just thought that was so cute. It says cool tractor and it's like a little John Deere tractor on it. A kind of grayish, bluish basket to go in her nursery. So I'm gonna try and figure out how to assemble this and make it look nice. I'm really bad at this. Usually my mom helps me with this. So we'll see how it goes. Okay, that's okay, I guess. <laughs> Man, this is kind of an ugly envelope. I kind of just want to leave the card like that. I'm not even gonna do the envelope because that just looks ugly. Actually, wait, mm, I don't know. It just looks so plain. I'm gonna leave it like that, but I'll keep this in case I need something else. Okay, this is the first dress, I literally washed my entire tan off. So I look pale, so that's great. I'm kind of not leaning towards this. I also didn't realize how short it was and how long it is at the back. And I did not tan my back. I haven't tanned my back in a long time. 
So I don't know how I'm feeling about this. I'm not really loving this area right now, so let's try on the other dress. It's cute, but the only thing I like about it is it has pockets and it's a long sleeve. So I guess my hair can kind of cover it. I also look very like poofy. I don't know, I'm not really I'm not really feeling it right now. Okay, this one I feel so much more comfortable in. This is what I'm wearing. It's from RW and Co. I got it last year on clearance. They have a similar style in all black. I gotta fix this bow. Okay, I'm wearing this. <laughs> I feel so much more comfortable and I can eat whatever in it because it's nice and padded here, which is great. Anyway, the print is beautiful. It's very like fall, like with little brown and white things. So anyway, I feel like this is very flattering for me and I like it. So this is what I'm wearing. <laughs> it might be a little hot. I think it's supposed to be like 20 degrees today, but I don't care. I don't, I don't care. We're going, oh, I need to put on a bra. Okay, we are back. I just changed into my cozies. Look at this sweater I found at the thrift store a couple weeks ago. I have no idea what it says. I'm loving it though. I like the vibes. Um, it also has no tag or anything like that, but it's 100% cotton and I was like, in my cart please. Anyway, so I'm quite happy. I'm freezing. I just made myself a tea. Sorry, I feel like I'm gonna go hectic right now. In my bat mug. Freaking bat. Brenton, his kind soul, has vacuumed. He's wiped all down the counters. He's done loads of laundry. I'm like, Dang. I do need to go to the grocery store, but he suggested we just eat. I have frozen salmon from Costco. I might just cook some rice and then make like a salad or something and that will be our dinner. And then tomorrow after work, I'll just run through the grocery store. So I think we're just gonna do that. So I just have to wash the floors and make dinner. I think that's my plan for tonight. I do need to clean up the den from my mess I made of me wrapping the present, but I might as well wrap my other friend's present for next weekend because we're going to the cottage and then I'm leaving the cottage early and then going straight there. So maybe I'll just do it while everything's out. Um, my God, I'm freezing. A quarter to six. So I'm gonna, the, El Brendan just took Elfie right. Oh my gosh, I can't talk. Brendan just took Elfie for a walk. So I'm going to mop the floors now that the dog's out of the house and get that done. Mopping is not that difficult because of this machine. This is not sponsored. This was gifted to me, I will say that. Some UGC content. Um, is that what it's called? I don't know. But I did that for them like way back in the spring and it was a mate, like I'm just obsessed with this thing. I think everyone should have one. They are expensive, so wait for them to go on sale because I think they are worth every penny, the sale penny. Yes, it makes my life so much easier, especially with the dog and how much mud he brings in the house. Like this is just perfect. So basically you fill up the water, put it in here. That's a cleaning solution that I just put in. That was like this deodorizing and cleaning solution. You just mop away. So you hold, turn it on and then you let it go. And it just does its thing. It will like pull you, I don't know if you can hear me, but it will pull you to where the dirtier areas are and will be like bright red. Like that just means you have to pull the vacuum over it more to clean the area. So like around Elfie's dish bowl, it's just bright red. But yeah, so this is my mopping. I didn't show myself cleaning the other rooms, but basically once you're done, you take the little filter off, take this apart like that, and then I just kind of rinse it. Back here collects all the hair and dirt. Oh, it's telling the vacuum talks. Whoops. Okay, it's hard to show and do it at the same time, but I just kind of take this off and then it collects all the hair for me. So I'm not drying it yet, just because it's still got some cleaning to do. So you put everything back. All right. Yeah, I'm just gonna grab the. Charging has commenced. Auto detecting. Oh, I didn't get this one. All right, shut up. Start self cleaning. Okay, so that was it, just cleaning itself. I'm doing a self-clean, so it's cleaning the brush roller and 
the dirty water tank. So this is it's self cleaning. And I'm just gonna dump the water and then that's it. That's it, that's how I wash my floors. 